the name Bluey uh, was given to me when I was at boarding school. I was uh, 12 years old, and my real name is Jean-Paul Edouard Monique. It's a bit of a mouthful for most people, but definitely for my room leader, who, uh, upon hearing my name, immediately called me Bluey. In making the video, we were trying to get the concept of uh, having its nights over Egypt, getting a theme that is uh, Eastern, that is Egyptian, and but without it being like here's uh, here's Egypt, you know, without going there, and uh, try to put London where we're from inside the video. We've got Mesa back in the band at the moment. Uh, she's done the album and touring with us. Uh, bringing back Jocelyn Brown on the album is, was a great coup for us because she's always a tower strength for us. And uh, we have new uh, members like Karen Bernard, uh, who's uh, uh, come from Erica Badu and D'Angelo. Interesting things that happen on on records all the time. You know, there's like there's a little bit of a uh, a, a little weird factor going on. You know, the spirits are at work all the time, and um, more so on this record than ever. I remember not uh, knowing what the uh, the vocals, the lyrics were to the second verse of Nights Over Egypt. We tried to track down the publishers to try and find out. We bought the Jones Girls original and tried to listen to it. Uh, Mesa said it was women followed him. Jocelyn said women fell at him. And I said, that makes no sense. We have to find the, 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 what the original lyric was. And um, to do so, I tracked down the writer of the song, you know, along with Cynthia Biggs. It's Dexter Wansell, who was like a big hero, you know, to me. You know, it's like influenced my music over the years. And it also gave me the opportunity of like speaking to the man. Finally, when traced uh, when I, we traced him down and uh, he called us and uh, and he gave us the right information. The words were women fellaheen as the fellaheen women of Egypt uh, and uh, where veils to be seen by no one, which makes total sense once you hear it. But sometimes songs are like this. But the most amazing thing was when I spoke to Dexter, I found that Dexter was at the same time cutting one of my tracks with a, with, with a singer, you know, with, with Billy Paul at the time, uh, which was... Um, uh, Deep Waters, a remaking of Deep Waters, which now I think is, is thinking of, of doing with, uh, possibly with Lou Rawls. No time like the future. Uh, we don't know what's around the corner. The most beautiful thing about life is surprises. And I like not knowing what the future is really bringing. Um, which is why we call ourselves incognito. I never know what I'm going to do next, but the most important thing is that we live a quality life of, of such quality that we're inspired to do new things and attempt new things. No time like the future because I'm really optimistic of the future in young people's hands. Yeah.